Hi, Valley of Peace. It is the week of November 1st, and this is the Faith in Place video. I'm outside today. Uh, we are looking at the story of Elijah and the widow and God's provision in a very um, hard time. And I'm outside. I'm thinking about the ways that God provides and sustains us. On Sunday, Pastor Ashley asked us to think about those empty places, those empty places that get filled. I brought a bottle out with me as I'm doing this reflection. And I decided to come outside because in this time, I have found um, such provision in our backyard, actually. And um, we, let's see if I can move here. We repainted the deck and the slides and the playground area. Uh, this summer and that has been such a provision for my kids as we couldn't go out into our community like we normally did um, so that was so so nice i also brought out my kindle um, finding uh, sustenance and provisions in maybe some unlikely places during this time um, i have definitely not had more time on my hands as we've all been home um, but i have found intentional times to read and um, really enjoy the stories and the gifts of the authors um, so i give thanks for that i also just give thanks for the sunshine and being able to get outside um, what a provision it is to get out of the house sometimes and um, so i give thanks for that and so this week i am asking you what sustains you? What sustains you during hard times, during times of drought in your life? A prayer for you this week. A stream provided water, the ravens provided food, a poor woman gave what she had to feed a stranger. Generous God, we realize that through the goodness of others and through the earth itself, you have made it possible for us to be provided with what we need. Thank you for the food we eat. Thank you for the world so sweet. Thank you for the birds that sing. Thank you, God, for everything. An act of human kindness was the sweet gift of one to another. Yet the greatest gift of all is the gift of your son and the gift of new life to the world. Thank you for the food we eat. Thank you for the world so sweet. Thank you for the birds that sing. Thank you, God, for everything. Amen.